Time seven. I like everyone. I have feelings for Awobakun, and I'm sure I've always had them. It's just that I realize them now. The Arglass. <gasps> I'll go apologize to the staff for breaking it. See ya. My face is burning up. Well done, Mayo. Eek! Aunt? I never thought that boy would request you. Look at you. No, that wasn't what today was about. If your skills have improved, we can use you again for the business. Huh? You want him to share more with you as a listening house girl, don't you? As a listening house girl? I wanted to know more about Awobakun and hear what he had to say, because I have feelings for him. Isn't that an ulterior motive? Can I seriously listen to Awobakun with these feelings? No relationships allowed? Huh? Manager Matsume, what's the meaning of this? I didn't say they're not allowed. I'm just saying that, with the inter-high district preliminaries next week, you should avoid phone calls and dates with your girlfriend and focus on practice and maintaining your fitness level. These are the supervisor's orders. Seriously? My one source of comfort. <laughs> See? It's cause you keep flirting with girls. <laughs> flirting? Senpai. So that's why you can't get any girls. You two don't have girlfriends either! Th that's right! Awabakun doesn't have a girlfriend. <gasps> I'm not interested in you, so don't get any ideas! Blah. How sad. I'll have to cancel all my plans with girls during our days off. Oh, I don't have a girlfriend either. You just purposely choose not to get one, Keosuki. The captain's popular, but it looks like you won't have to worry about him. There aren't many people like Taiki who don't get distracted by girls. He's straight-laced, all right. <gasps> hey! Captain, stop! Captain Iwase! Huh? He doesn't hear Matsume-san. He gets like this when he plays basketball. Taiki! Uh, Captain, you have a bruise on your left arm. Let's tape that up. Incredible. Matsume is the same age as me, but she's so tough. She's even so confident around the senpai. Oh, no one addresses their senpai like that. She should listen to her own advice about relationships not being allowed. Seriously. Hmm. What's that about? Now then, starting today, you'll be taking care of our student customers. Student customers? It can be easier for them to open up to a person in the same age group. Besides, students don't bring in much money. So you'll do. Aunt is so mean. It doesn't look like I'll get to hear from Awobakun for now. So I'll work hard listening to other customers. Look! A female high school student is already here! Matsume-san? Aunt's headscarf. Oh no, it's someone I know again. If I get discovered again, I'm done for. What could it be? She seems different from usual. Um... Eek! Look, I wasn't gonna come to this sketchy shop, but an acquaintance of mine suggested it. If you give me any strange invitations, we're done here. Uh, okay. She isn't leaving, so... Uh... Everything you share stays in this room. I'm really just here to listen. Please share anything you want. You mean that? I yes I came here to get this off my chest. I like a guy who's on the same team as me, but... Since relationships aren't allowed now, 
I'm thinking of taking this chance to give up on him completely. Someone on the basketball team? Who? She sure doesn't show any of that. W what kind of person is he? A childhood friend. When we were little, the two of us would play in the yard where my dad had set up a basketball net. He really liked basketball, and that made me like basketball too. Whoa, Matsume-san looks so happy. So cute. As if I was chasing him, I joined the same basketball team in both junior high and high school. He has no idea whatsoever, and nothing will come of it. Also, he's so passionate about basketball that if he knew, he'd push me away. Thinking that I'm only serving as manager with those motives. She's exactly like me. That's why I'm gonna give up on him. I want him to do well in basketball, and I also want to focus on being a manager. I came here so I could get that off my chest. Matsume-san is amazing. She follows through on what she thinks is right. But... Do you... Really want to give him up, though? W well <gasps> Isn't that obvious? Anyway, here. 500 yen for 10 minutes. Keep the receipt. Don't you dare tell anyone, okay? Matsume-san... She knows in her head that she should give him up, but the truth is, it's not that easy. I understand that now, too. Okay, next we're gonna practice defense. I wonder if there's anything I can do to help without exposing myself. Matsume, is the captain still not here? He was in the library during sixth period. Could he be there? Yeah, could be. Since way back, he's never been able to put a book down once he starts. I'll go get him. Since way back? Could the person she likes be... Uh, I'll go with you! What's with her? Class is over, Iwase-kun. Hmm. Is he completely oblivious? Interesting! He's so inattentive to everything except basketball. <laughs> oh, Captain! Hey, so the basketball team isn't allowed to have relationships right now, yeah? But you're available after the district preliminaries, no? Captain! You have practice now, please hurry! Oh, right! Thanks, Kyoko! <laughs> so I guess the rumors were true. That Iwasakun is followed around by the first year manager. I mean, she's hung around our school's basketball team since junior high, right? She's infamous around the second year girls. She goes to such lengths, and Iwasakun still doesn't give her the time of day. It has nothing to do with you, senpai. Okay, let's tell them you have personal reasons for joining the team. The other members are going to be so annoyed. Stop it! So she does like him. The team doesn't allow relationships, so why don't you just quit already? It's not like that. Well, what should I do? Someone has to help her. Of course I don't like Tai... Me too! I also like Taiki-senpai. Who's this? I think it's the other manager. Sakurada-san? <coughs> and Tsuyoshi-senpai, and Kyosuke-senpai, and Naokun, and... Awabakun! I like everyone! It's because I like them that I can support them and do my best as their manager. There's nothing wrong with liking your teammates. You like five boys? How crazy are you? You have something to say to our manager? L let's go! Ryosuke, you're scary, man. You think so? Honestly, you didn't have to cover for me. People are gonna start looking at us, you know? Uh, I meant what I said. They can't prohibit people from having feelings. Kyoko? 
Come on, you guys. Let's start practice already. We came to get you, you know. I can't do anything as an employee of this listening house. But as a friend, it's okay, right? Thanks. I take back what I said earlier, so just forget it. Huh? It seems that I tried to give up my feelings by making up a noble reason that it wasn't going to lead anywhere. I realized that talking to you. And also because of something that someone else said. I'm not going to give up because I like him after all. And I'm going to work even harder as a manager. Phew. You know, I couldn't tell this to any of my friends. Thanks for hearing me out. The listening house sure is a nice place. See ya. That's the first time anyone's ever thanked me at the listening house. So you solved it. Uh, oh, Obakun. I kept quiet about it, just so you know. I'm the one who recommended her to the listening house. Huh? I was worried because the manager had a serious look on her face. She doesn't seem the type to open up to others, you know. I had a feeling you'd be able to do something about it. Sorry for relying on you for something strange like this. Not at all! Uh, I'm glad! When Matsume-san thanked me, I... I... I felt like I finally helped someone at the listening house. And I felt so happy. Thanks to you, Oobakun. Not at all. That was all you. It's all thanks to Oobakun. It's because of my feelings for you, Oobakun, that I can do my best at the listening house and on the team. <gasps> what? 